What is up everybody? Welcome back. We are at the ranch and uh, we're going to sit in the stand. It feels weird getting in the stand this early in the year, but uh, unfortunately I won't be here for opening uh, archery season here in Texas. I'll be elk hunting. So I am out here going to see what we can uh, get on. Who knows what's going to come in. Pigs, Audad, Black Buck, Axis. Never know what's going to come in out here. So, getting my bow set up. Got some iron wheel broadheads. Going to throw a few of these in the quiver. And uh, we are going to go sit in the stand. We may actually stay. And we may uh, stick around till after dark and see if we can't find some pigs with the thermal. If we can't get anything down uh, before dark. So, stay tuned. It's a beautiful day here in Texas, and uh, it's a good day to sit in the stand. All right, guys, hopped in the electric cart. Do a little sneaky sneak, and uh, probably need my tripod. Well, guys, I was walking to my stand, and there's a couple pigs just feeding out in the wide open. Oh, there's a bunch of pigs. So, I'm gonna get over here and I'm gonna leave this camera here. Take y'all with the zoom camera. See if we can sneak into these pigs. There's a bunch. I'll switch y'all over to the zoom camera so y'all can see them.
Man, guys, so close to getting an odd dad with the bow. I waited and waited and waited. He just never gave me the shot I wanted. <clears throat> and uh, lost camera light and even until dark though, he never gave me the shot that I was looking for. So, oh well, it was a great hunt, great sit. That was so much fun. Um, I was actually surprised at, uh, at how early they came out. Had a good wind. Let me set y'all down for a second. So I actually saw, I'll see you guys when I get back into some light so y'all can see me and uh, explain kind of what happened there. So anyway, the, y'all are real dusty. Sorry about that. Um, so the first one I saw was to the right of the field and I thought he was gonna come straight in. And then he looked over left, so I looked left here comes the giant with the female and the uh, baby. So they came in, obviously, and uh, just never presented a shot. And then it got too uh, got too dark for the camera, and I just wasn't comfortable with it. I probably could have squeezed off a shot um, right, pretty much right whenever I was running out of camera light. But it would have been he had been half walking and. Uh, just wasn't comfortable with it so it was an awesome sit it's awesome to get back in the stand I'm ready for deer season but first we got elk hunting so I'm headed home uh, and I'm gonna do some stuff with my bow tomorrow and tell y'all a little about tell y'all a little bit about the elk hunt that's coming up and uh, we'll hang out at the house for a little while so I'll see you guys in the morning and uh, shoot the bow all right guys it is the next morning and uh, out here doing a little shooting with the rider. We're at 32 yards right here and uh, making sure everything's dialed in. Leave here in a few days for, we're hunting uh, a private, a big private ranch. Uh, it's on the border of New Mexico and Colorado. A little more archery elk hunting. So it's the last elk hunt of the year, but Making sure we're dialed in. <laughs> Is that cool? Hitting the hair low. I got it set to 30, so 32 yards should be hitting the hair low. All right, let's go see where we're at. Come on. You want to run? Run, 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 run. All right, that's 32. I got to back up. Shoot at 50 and 60. Pretty good group. Like I said, it's a little low. Uh got to make a few adjustments but pretty good group <laughs> got to move it down the driveway so I can get shoot further we are at See where we're at. <laughs> All right, let's go see what we did at 60. Well, they're all in a line, not the best group, but 60 yards, not completely terrible I moved over every single shot so do that again see if we can get that tiger 
Well guys, I think I'm shooting pretty good. Uh, I'm gonna, I shoot every day. I'm gonna shoot every day until I get to the elk hunt too. Uh, I also like to shoot while I'm on these hunts. Uh, just keep everything fresh. But as you can see, I got Audad all over the place. That is, that is a South Texas Audad. I got New Mexico Audad. I got another Audad right there. Those two big boys. But Audad are seriously one of my favorite animals to hunt. So it was awesome getting those big boys in last night. Uh, definitely gonna do a lot of Audad hunting this year. So hope you guys enjoy this video. A little vlog style for you. Didn't make it happen on the hunt, but I figured y'all like to see it uh, as a fun sit. And uh, the first sit of uh, 2021 deer season, I guess. I wasn't hunting for deer though, so I don't know if that counts. But uh, I will see you guys in the elk woods very soon. If y'all want to get any Mullet Man merch or my spices or Mullet Man Bait Co. baits, go to mulletman.net. It will be linked in the description. Y'all can get all that stuff there. Um, I will be fishing a lot soon as well. The trout bite, the winter trout bite is about to be on. So we're going to be throwing plastics all winter. And uh, I would love for y'all to use my plastics. Moltmanbaitco.com and uh, go get you some. So until next time, make sure y'all hit that subscribe button, hit the thumbs up, and remember, eat good.